Tonight is the dress rehearsal for uh, the first of the two Lessons in Carols services and the choir's worked very hard all fall. We're going to be doing the Lessons in Carols annual service which is a beautiful um, combination of readings from the Bible leading up to the birth of Jesus and carols that go along with it that span centuries of music. It's a variety of music, old and new from Renaissance and Baroque to contemporary and living composers with also a lot of hymns that the congregation sings also with the choir. We have a phrase at Marsh Chapel that we are a heart for the heart of the city and a service in the service of the city. And I like to think that the Marsh Chapel Choir is a heart for the heart of Marsh Chapel and a service in the service of Marsh Chapel. We have this kind of shared love and shared interest in liturgical music and singing and being a part of a choir. And I think there's such a familial aspect to the choir as well. I think it's very powerful on multiple levels, emotionally, physically, for both musicians and the people who are listening to it. But I absolutely love just the difference that you can uplift a spirit, you can encourage somebody, you can just have a wonderful, fun time, or you can also touch somebody who's going through a difficult time in their life. We are giving uh, a significant leadership component to a worship service and the Lessons and Carols is very much a performance, but it's also a service. And I think that um, that informs our musical contribution in a unique and special way that makes, um, that makes the singing um, maybe more meaningful. Looking out into the audience and seeing somebody cry, so which touched me because I was surprised at first, um, but I went and talked with them afterwards and they said that it, the music spoke to them and that they were able to release this sadness and this emotion that they'd been holding in with inside themselves. So I thought, I mean, the power of that itself moved me. So that's why I pursue music. It's um, an incredible thrill to be in the middle of that energy from those people, those singers giving so much of themselves to the fuller identity of the chorus. To be in the middle of that is a thrilling experience and um, I, I love it and I love working with this choir. Hallelujah.